Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I have got a super light review but I have a tutorial for y'all. Um, today I decided to go for kind of a Barbie pink kind of look with lots of shimmer. Tried to get the highlight on point too. But today I have got this eye tutorial for you using none other than the chocolate gold palette. Now this thing, one, gorgeous, absolutely beautiful. The packaging itself sold me without even having to see the inside. Like I saw the preview and I was like, Bye. buying it because this is beautiful. <clears throat> so then we open her up and we have got a big mirror. It's bigger than most of them because it doesn't have a border. And then we have got this gorgeous assortment, mostly shimmers with four mattes. And they are just, it is the biggest range of shimmers I think I've really seen, at least from Too Faced. I know that for sure, <clears throat> but it is absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> so um, what I wanted to do for y'all today is get you some swatches. I'm sure you've already seen them. But you haven't seen mine, so <laughs> I'm going to get you some swatches. It's going to take three times because there's a lot of colors and I don't have that much room on my arm. So we are going to have three slides of swatches and then we're going to have a quick tutorial and my final thoughts. So if you're interested in some swatches, those are coming up next. If you're interested in this look, that will be right after. So uh, keep watching. If you aren't already subscribed to my channel, be sure you go ahead and hit that red button and hit that bell. I am almost at 500 and I'm recording this on Wednesday. You should be seeing this on Saturday and hopefully by the time you see this, I will have hit my 500 subscribers, which is amazing. And halfway to my 1000 subscriber giveaway. Um, which is going on in collaboration with Crate Finds. I will give you more details about that as I get closer to my thousand. But um, I'm just so excited, you guys. I hope you enjoy this video. I hope you like this look. If you have this palette, uh, leave me your thoughts in the comments. And if you have some videos, tell me. I would love to check out some other looks. I need some other ideas because I've only cracked into this baby once and it's been sitting here for a month. This is the first time I've used it and I want to use it some more because it is so stinking pretty. So uh, <laughs> leave me some love down there, leave me a thumbs up if you like this video, and here we go for your swatches. Okay, so first I just wanted to swatch out these four mattes for y'all. You have your light, your tan, your brown, and your black. They're pretty pigmented and they work really good in the crease and they blend well, but these are your only mattes in the palette. Okay, so here we have the first six shimmers. It's Hollow for a Dollar, Love and Cocoa, Money Bags, Chocolate Gold, Old Money, and Gold Dipped. These are all completely and totally one swap swatches. Okay, so here are our other six shimmers in the palette. You have got Rich Girl, New Money, Living Lavish. Drippin' Diamonds, Famous, and Classy and Sassy, and that was this way over. These are gorgeous. They are all one swap except for the pink and the purple. They're still super pigmented. They just took two swaps to get that much of a swatch, but all these four, like, I could have kept going. I still had eyeshadow left. So these are super gorgeous. <laughs> Okay guys, so we are super zoomed in and ready to go on this tutorial. Y'all, this palette's just so pretty. Okay, <clears throat> the first thing I'm going to go into is Rollin' in Dough. That's right here. And this is just our straight tan. I'm taking it on a Morphe E27. It's a synthetic blending brush. And I'm just going to lay that down all over the lid. And in the crease. Thank you. 
Okay, so the next thing we're gonna do is dip into So Bougie, which I love that shade name. I've been saying bougie since before the song. That is my turn. <laughs> and I love that name. So we're just gonna put this in the crease. Okay, so next we're gonna go into Coco Truffle, that's right here. And we're gonna put that in the same spot and just build that color up some more. Okay, so now I'm gonna take my Morphe 433, it's an M433, and I'm just gonna take Decadent, this is the black shade in the palette, and pop that into my outer corner and like the outer edge of my lid. <laughs> okay, you guys, so I would cut a crease, but I don't want to do that for this look. <sighs> Ever since I got my hands on this palette, I have just been dying. To dip into the shade which is weird because I'm usually a silver person but we're going into new money it looks kind of purple right now in the viewfinder but it is actually a super bright pink if you can see right here still looks kind of purple but <laughs> we're gonna take that and just put it all over the lid with our finger Okay, so uh, that is it for the eyelid. I'm going to hop off of here while I find some liner and some lashes, and then we'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back, and those lashes gave me more trouble than I think any lashes ever had. It's late, that's my excuse. <clears throat> so now I'm just gonna go into um, Cocoa Truffle. And I'm going to put that on my lower lash line. And I'm taking it on a Luxie 239. This is a precision shader. And just buffing it right into this lower lash line. Sorry guys, didn't mean to get out of frame. And then I'm going to grab a little bit of Rich Girl right here. And I'm going to put that in my inner corner. And I'm just going to do that with my finger very carefully as to not disturb these lashes. And ooh, that is pretty. That's absolutely gorgeous. And I'm going to add a little bit of new money just on the inner corner of my lower lash line to tie everything together a little bit. Okay, and now all I think I still need is some mascara on my lower lashes because I snuck a lippy in while I was off camera. Okay, so here is our final look. So, final thoughts on this palette. Okay, number one, absolutely gorgeous. All you have to do is see the packaging. It's to die for. And I have basically every other chocolate bar palette. And then I saw this one and it just spoke to my... Like, I didn't have to see the colors. I just saw this. But it's amazing. It is super pigmented. Since this is the chocolate gold, it's got more shimmers than anything, so, I mean, as far as your crease colors, unless you work with shimmers in your crease, you are going to be a little limited as to what you can do, um, which, I mean, that's not a bad thing. You just lay down your basic crease colors, pick what you want on your lid, you can do something different for, like, 12 days straight. 
crease will always be the same. It'll always be easy to do. And you just pick a different gorgeous. gorgeous. Shimmer to put on your lid. And I see nothing wrong with that. Now, if you're someone who likes to play with different crease colors, I mean, no, you're probably not going to use this every day, but it is a really nice palette. It's got a great assortment of super pigmented, absolutely gorgeous, wonderful colors. Yeah, I mean, I can't say enough. I know there's always drama with Too Faced. I understand that and I hear that, but this palette is beautiful, just like all their other chocolate bar palettes and their peach palette. It's amazing. So uh, that's going to be my review for this palette. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, you guys.